It's been nearly six years since someone shot and killed ODU student Chris Cummings in his home near the university and still no arrests. From the day it happened, 10 on your side has been trying to get answers. 10 on your side's Katie Collette joined us now live in the newsroom with the details of this Norfolk crime that is resonating in Maryland. Investigators say they are confident they will catch who did it. 10 on your side's Katie Collette joins us now to talk more about the investigation. Now, because of our consistent coverage over the years, Chris's father, James, contacted me and asked if I would be willing to once again share the story of Chris's death with any new information I could find. He and his wife, Rosa, say these past few years have been filled with promise and frustration where the police investigation is concerned. And they would say that they, uh, they had these people of interest and things were going to happen. They knew things were going to change. Uh, the case would be solved within the next, they figured, a year or so, but a year would pass and nothing would happen. And when I talked to them, they said, well, um, we got a few things, we think we are close right now, um, but we can't discuss anything. Tonight, we'll take you back to the scene and reveal new details from a witness who was in the home when the shooting happened. The emotional story of Chris Cummings, a long wait for justice, tonight on Wavy News 10 at 6 with coverage starting at 4.